Larry Bibby from Grants Pass, Oregon, suffered a concussion and damage to her olfactory nerve. She lost her sense of smell. One night she was watching this program, and you, Terry, gave this word of knowledge, quote, someone else, I don't know, understand it, but you have some sort of olfactory nerve damage you can't smell, so you can't taste your food. But God is restoring it. Debbie felt a warm sensation all over her body. She opened a bottle of barbecue sauce, and she could smell it. Then she took a bite of a strawberry and could taste it, and she's had normal smell wow. and taste since. Wow, Isn't that's that awesome. You didn't know Debbie, did you, in Grants so Pass, Oregon? Debbie, right. but I sure am happy for you, Debbie. Right. <laughs> this is David, who lives in Harrison, Michigan. He had a painful left knee that had been popping out for the past three months. Had to wear a brace on that knee. His doctor, doctor actually recommended a knee replacement. He was praying for God to heal his knee. Then last November, David was watching this program, and Pat, you gave this word of knowledge. There's somebody. Your leg is actually cantilevered over your left leg, it's like splayed out and there's something in the knee joint. Right now, just put your hand on that leg and in the name of Jesus, it's straightening out and it's completely whole. Thank you, Lord. So David put his hands on his knee while we were praying. He took the brace off and walked down the hall with no pain. He has had no pain since then. Right. Praise God. Listen, that's just the warm up of what God's going to do for you. There's nothing impossible. We're talking about the one who created everything, and he said this year is going to be a year of extraordinary miracles. So Terry and I are going to join hands right now on this program for you, right now at the beginning of this new year, and we're going to believe God for a miracle. Lord, I join with my sister in Christ, and you said if two of us would agree on anything, that you, it would be done for them by our Father which is in heaven. And we agree right now. I ask for extraordinary miracles to take place in this audience in Jesus' name. Uh, Charlie, you've got a coughing fit, and the Lord is healing you right now. Your lungs are completely healed. And somebody else, you've had a ringing in your ear for several years. It's just stopped, and that ear has opened up, and you're kind of shaking your head in disbelief. You've been healed today in Jesus' name. You, somebody's in your face. You've got. It's like a, a, a disease that's eating the skin in your face. Just reach up and touch it, and the Lord just healed it. It'll be like a baby's skin in the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. Terry? Somebody else, you have like a strawberry birthmark on your face that um, just is going to fade away. You've had it for a long time. It's just going to be gone. Thank you, Lord. Perfect love casts out fear. There are a number of you that are seized by fear. Do not fear. The Lord is with you right now. Mm -hmm. Receive this, and in your heart you will no longer be afraid. In Jesus' name, thank you, Lord. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Father. Wherever you are, give us a call if we can help you. We've got folks on the phones all day long. They're waiting to pray for you. They'd love to do it. And if you've had an answer to prayer, tell us about it because that builds the faith of others. So we're here for you.